Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial. Now this one's going to be on the short side, but let me show you this dilemma I've been having. First, let's have a listen. Now, if you've noticed, as soon as the note starts until it ends, it's going at 100%. It's like a robot is playing just predetermined notes. There's no expression, there's no human emotion being emulated at all. There's no attack and release. Because in this plugin we have here, the BBC Orchestra, there is no options for attack and release. To emulate that, you would need to play it live in real time with a MIDI keyboard controller with uh, a wheel for modulation, dynamics, and expression. Now, if you had uh, a MIDI keyboard, you could uh, just turn the knobs whenever you wanted to, like lower it, raise it, so you can have some more human feel. But let's say for whatever reason, you don't have a MIDI keyboard or you don't want to bring it out or let's say the notes are already set and done but now what do we do there's no way in the plugin to emulate that so we can't do it with this but luckily we can tie something to the plugin that allows us to do that and even more luckily it's this right here the volume and pan it's already built into every single track but for whatever reason, if it's gone, you can just add plugin. It should be a waveform, utility. Is it instrument? No, it's effect. Volume and pan, there it is. It's an effect. Add it in. There's an example. We don't need that, though. We'll delete that. So all we have to do is go to automation and then show default automation curve on each track. It'll make this little blue line pop up. If we click it, it turns red. This is for the volume and pan plugin. See, it's just by default. Now to add a node, if we just drag it now, it's just gonna increase and lower the volume as you can see here. We don't want that. Instead, we want to put a node. We can do that by either double clicking. There's a node there. Let me move this out of the way. There we go, we made one. We can double click. An easier way to do that is just hold Alt and wherever you click, one will pop up. They're in uh, increments here, so we can't put them in between. Let me remove these. So let's say we have these two increments right here. I can then drag this down. And now this should fade in. Let's have a listen. See, we can now manually add in, add in these nodes line is in the way we can add these nodes in and just fade this in and out wherever we want if just to emulate artistic expression and now you notice whenever we add two nodes this dot appears in between we can click this and drag it for basically curvature let's say if this is too linear of a attack we can just go here and it'll be a more gradual and then steep Incline here. Let's have a listen to that. And it goes down, and goes back up, and goes back down. That's pretty much it. You can just get as creative as you want with it. Hold on. Just add a bunch. If you want to get really detailed, you really want to get into the, the nitpicking of these. And then you can drag the curvature around. We can get more detailed, as detailed as you want. Anyway, this is an easy way to add note expression to your MIDI track. It may be tedious, but you have full control and can basically emulate, you know, the human emotion attack and release as, as best as possible. Anyway, I hope this helped some of you. I'll see you next time, and bye-bye.